Sharon, what's the name of this movie? I'm not sure, hey? I haven't really been paying attention. I've been on my phone. You on your phone? <laughs> what do you mean me on my phone? You know I've been checking what Pastor Ken has been sending. I'm, I'm in the group. You've even bent my ladish. No, today. It wasn't me who was cooking today. Mm. It was Sandra. Mm. Are you sure? Yes, it's Sandra's today. It's Sandra's day today. <sighs> Shut up, do you think of these kittens, eh? They're white. They're angelic. They're beautiful. Majestic. But do they really match? Anything white matches anywhere. Okay. And that reminds me. I was with Silas today. What about Silas? Sharon, you know what? You need to give that young man a chance. Silas loves you very much. I don't understand when you say I should give him a chance. That guy is not even a Christian. I think he's an atheist. But he loves you. I know he loves me. You keep telling me he loves me, but the fact that he's not a Christian, I don't think I can ever be in a relationship with a person who, who is not a Christian. I mean, I want someone who has a relationship with God, not just someone who's just, I don't know, what, whatever he does. Sharon, you know what? Even the Bible, in 1 Corinthians 13 verse 13, says all this remains love faith and hope and the greatest but the greatest is love love is what is important if someone has love for you, you have everything in the world silas loves you very much i can he can do every, anything for you can go to church with you can pray with you can even fast with you what else do you need? And there you are telling me he can go to church with me, for me. Yes. No, I don't want him to go to church That's for me. That's how much he loves you. He can do anything for you. No, I want him to go to church for himself, to have a relationship with God. You know what? If Silas was a, a Christian, I would definitely consider dating him. Because he's good looking. He's charming. But the fact that he's not a Christian, I don't think I can date that guy. Sharon, just think about this. Just think about Silas. Think about his love. He loves you and that is what is important, period. I can't. I really cannot. The guy just, he just doesn't have a relationship with God. I've always dreamt of a husband who is going to be a Christian. It, he just someone who I can pray with because you know the Bible says two is better than one I can't just be the only person who is a Christian in a relationship I need someone I can pray with someone I can hold hands pray with fast with whatever it is we can go through it together come on Sharon